How did you decide to become a hacker? <laughs> well, I'm not really sure what it means to become a hacker. That's like some guy in a hoodie who types really fast and stays up all night writing code and cracking passwords. It's not me. I just spy on people and see what makes them click. It's not a bad job. Mark Hanning, CEO of Qualicart, set to report earnings after their blockbuster IP. So you consider this a job? I put a lot of work into this. I'm not lazy. It takes research to figure out the key players, and learn all about them, their families, their friends, what they care about. You have to understand the company's organization. I get a lot of my information from the sales department because they're always so quick and eager. They're hungry. People trust too easily. They don't look at the details. I do. Details matter. That's what I'm good at. It has to look completely believable. It has to look familiar. This is where research is important. It's not some generic piece of spam. It's an email from their boss with their company signature. It's written in the voice of the boss. It's what he would say if he were writing this. What about the malware itself? How does that work? Somebody else out there already wrote all the code that does the actual attack. I'm just using it in the attachment. My skill is in my ability to get a bunch of people to click on that attachment. I always wonder what it's like when the whole thing unfolds on their end, when the panic sets in. Please leave your message after the beep. Hey, this is Rajiv in finance. Call me as soon as you get this. Something's up with my laptop. I can't Katie, are you on your way to the office? Something's going on with our file uh, server. This is the Karen in HR. Our benefits dashboard seems really slow. We're getting calls from users on it. Can you call when you get this? Joining conference now. Currently, there's a malware attack targeting our main... It's ransomware. They're holding us hostage. We're locked out of everything. I, I can't even check my phone. What about the backup? That will take days. We need this fixed now. You pay it. We don't have a choice. We're reporting earnings in two hours. But how do we know Just that they'll... pay it. Put every single person on getting us back up and running. That's the only priority now. Okay, it's done. I have the decrypt key. Mark, we have a big problem. The ransomware was just to distract us. They got inside. They got everything. Customer data, financials, everything. Qualicards is reeling today from the news that hackers have released the personal information of nearly the 2 Nasdaq million. The Nasdaq closed lower today, led by Qualicard, which was down 14% on news that their recent data breach may be far worse than the company originally stock announced. fell to a new all-time low on news that CEO Mark Hanning is stepping down after what is turning out to be one of the worst breaches of personal information in recent history. Do you feel bad about releasing the personal information? All the financials? All the money that was lost? All I did was get the files. I'm not the one that decided to release them. I'm not the one that shorted the stock. Somebody else had their reasons for that. It's above my pay grade. I was paid to do a job, and I did it well. And that's what's expected of anyone, isn't it? Anyway, markets bounce back.